The candidates for mayor of Austin lashing out tonight about campaign donations made with ties to Formula One. With just less than a week before the election, this accusation questions whether Mayor Lee Leffingwell broke the law when reporting those contributions. KXAN's Josh Hinkle is here live with an in-depth look at this controversy. Well, it's all right here. After searching through all 65 pages of Mayor Leffingwell's latest campaign finance report, we found numerous donations from people connected to Formula One. But that's not the problem. It all depends on how he got that money and whether he reported it legally. Formula One, a big business endeavor promising thousands of jobs in Austin. When her opponent started drawing big bucks from the folks surrounding the race, Bridget Shea took aim. It's directly connected to an entity that's gotten a huge public benefit and where there's tremendous controversy in the course of the campaign around it. Major names on Mayor Lee Leffingwell's campaign finance report, like F1 investor Red McCombs and Circuit of the Americas President Steve Sexton, they help make up a list of 23 donors with F1 ties, totaling $8,300, all given on the same day, May 2nd. The issue brings us to a term called bundling. Individuals can only give $350, so someone else can gather money from a lot of people and then give that total amount to the campaign. Not illegal, but but there are rules. The city charter says the campaign must report the name and address of any person who solicits and obtains contributions on their behalf, the bundler. That goes for fundraising events that bring in more than $5,000. And if it was at an event and they clearly received more than $5,000, they have to report who hosted it. A member of the Leffingwell campaign told KXAN it wasn't an official event, just a coffee meeting. When asked who the meeting was with, people with F1 ties. The money came from them and others who found out Leffingwell was there. Another campaign member said there wasn't one person who gathered the money. So Even if it's a meeting with the Formula One officials this is all about? Uh, I think that it would be a campaign event and not an official meeting. And yes, if an individual shows up and hands over their money, that is not bundling. A matter of whose interpretation of the law is right. Lee Leffingwell has gone above and beyond the law every reporting period as far as reporting bundlers go. In fact, Leffingwell's report does list bundlers from other donations received separate from the F1 connected contributions. And the latest, the mayor's campaign says Shea solicited, solicited consulting work from F1 last sum, summer, something her campaign has not responded to just yet. Josh Hinkle, KXAN News.